Concrete is the lifeline of our society. It's the most widely used material on the planet and contributes around 8% of the global CO2 emissions because we need very high temperatures to produce this material, but also we convert some minerals that release CO2 during the process of manufacturing. My research centers on different aspects of improving sustainability of concrete. One of the projects I have is in developing alternative green cements called alkali activated materials using the industrial byproducts from different industries. So these materials can be produced at room temperatures, which is one of the main advantages. The area within that I'm particularly looking at is the use of clays. We have to really understand what is going on at the mineralogical level to learn how we can actually use them to make cements. It's typically made using what we call a two-part process. So we have you know, the solid clays and we have a alkaline activator and we need that to dissolve the clay minerals to get them to react. We're thinking about durability because these are low CO2 materials that we want to improve how long they last in the field and one of the biggest durability challenges that we have today is actually the corrosion of steel reinforcement. So we actually use accelerated testing and that way we can actually degrade or age the material at a faster rate than the real world. The insight that we learn from that can be extrapolated to real-time scales. We have some of the best facilities in the country to perform research in cement and concrete materials. We have from nuclear magnetic resonance spectrometers to different environmental chambers that can simulate from marine conditions to extreme heat conditions. So it was really interesting to kind of bring all these resources together and think about the innovation that we can bring forth with it. As a construction material scientist, you really want to make the biggest impacts and improve the world as much as you can. We try to find new manufacturing routes for these materials. Use less manufactured cement and therefore improve the environmental impact. So that also makes these new friendly cements, very versatile and potentially available all over the globe.